four weeks pregnant. As of like Friday. Today's the Tuesday, Wednesday. Jeez Louise. And uh, had my 24 week appointment today um, where we had the glucose test. It's not gonna be that bad, but I'm just nervous because everyone else says it is. It's not like that much drink. What time is it? I have five minutes. It's 7:58, so just gotta drink it. In five minutes, it's not. Let's chug it all right now. Look, it's in a biohazard bag. <laughs> it doesn't smell bad. Let's chug it then. Is it kind of full? It does taste like fruit punch, though. That's all. It, like, it doesn't taste bad. It just tastes like fruit punch. I just don't really like fruit punch. You have to drink all of it? Yeah. I can't try it. Hmm? I can't try it. Maybe just, like, a little bit. Ugh. Probably gonna make it taste good. It does. It's just like it's like extra sweet fruit punch. I just don't really like fruit punch. I wish I could have had the orange one. If they have the orange one. Reminds me of the fruit punch barrel drinks. What sucks too is you can't have anything afterwards, so that taste is just like in your mouth. Fruit. Punch. <laughs> <laughs> It's like regenerating. Just drink it. It's, my stomach's hurting. I think my stomach hurt. Oh. Anna's really early. I think that's like the other problem. <laughs> <laughs> We're on our way to the appointment. Um, my stomach doesn't really hurt anymore. It pretty much just hurt right after I finished the drink. Um, I don't feel like my blood sugar is high. Do you think I have gestational diabetes? the test. You failed it too. I failed it. Yeah, it's partially your fault because you made that sandwich this morning. Uh, so you are supposed to be, after one hour after drinking that glucose drink, you're supposed to be uh, at 135 or less on your blood sugars. And I was 139. So literally like four points over, which is seriously like super minimal. When it comes to blood sugars but it does mean I failed it means that I have to go do the three hour test now which is gonna be like so much worse because for one you have to be fasting eight hours before and two you have to sit there like the whole time in the doctor's office you have to go there to take the drink sit in the office for three hours and then get tested and then if you fail that it means that you have gestational diabetes which I don't I don't think anyone really wants that, but uh. we gotta 
I do is wait to sit. Yeah, but I'll be so hungry and so thirsty and so cranky. And you gotta deal with all that. And you gotta deal with all that. I'm already cranky because I'm thirsty. But for this one, I'll have to be fasting eight full hours before and the whole three hours of the, the nurse that took my blood said that she doesn't think that I actually probably have gestational diabetes because it was so close, which I think so too. She said, she asked if I had anything to eat and I did. I had like two bites of a sandwich. She's like, oh, well, bread's full of sugar. That might be what it is. I was like, well, for, like for one, this test isn't supposed to be fasting. So, like, I could have eaten the whole sandwich before, and it wouldn't, like, have been, like, against the rules or anything. But also, two freaking bites. I mean, maybe because it was only four points. But I think it's because I, like, haven't had anything to drink in the last hour for waiting. And it's the morning, so I haven't really been drinking in the last, like, eight hours. So I think I might be a little dehydrated, but we're about to get some Starbucks. That's, like, all the money I just filled up on this card. That's okay. So you get for getting food at Starbucks. Yeah. What do I get for taking you to Starbucks? Oh, it's really hot. It's like green. Oh, it's peach. makes everything better. Except for my wallet. <laughs> <laughs>